our time. Hi, welcome to this lesson. I think real the most difficult part here on this song is the finger picking pattern because the structure is really really very simple. But I admit that the finger picking pattern um, it might give a little bit of trouble to some players. Even myself I had to practice a little bit and it was kind of difficult to hear what exactly he was doing. But okay, here it is. Basically you must practice alternating uh, on the bass with the thumb and on the higher notes with your middle and index finger. You have to practice this movement, okay? Thumb, middle, thumb, middle. Then thumb, middle, thumb, index, thumb, middle, thumb, index. Then I'm playing um, on the second string with the middle and on the third string with the index almost always like this so let me play this first bar so you can see what am i am i doing but basically is this um, when i play that t on the fourth string i also use the index i kind of prefer to use these fingers instead of the classical way three fingers per string because i i think represents best what i'm hearing when he's playing the kind of accents and the kind of line that he's doing so, um, also notice the rhythm on the first bar. We have eight note and then uh, just sixteen notes. Okay, ta 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 ta. So don't forget the rhythm. Slowly, ta 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 ta. Here we go. Three, four. last note is already on the next bar okay once again play with me three four now let's take a look at the next bar practice this hammer on on the fourth string play with the thumb on the right hand then play these two notes at the same time as you can see on the tab okay so the second bar once again until the end and you start singing here also notice the rhythm we have uh, an eighth note on the first beat and the eighth note on the third beat. Okay, so the rhythm. Try to play with me. Three, four. And the voice gets in. It's very important if you practice this because you can use this all through the song. Uh, he's playing some other things, some amarants and doing some variations on this line but I won't uh, transcribe all of these details just this uh, main finger picking pattern that you can use then all through the song and you can look at the structure that I've written for you below and you just have to follow that so the chords as you can see are very simple we have the G we have the C uh, we'll have the, the G, then followed by a, a G with F sharp on the bass, then E minor. You can simplify these chords, you don't have to put all the fingers. For example, on the G, if you just play, if you don't play the first string, you don't have to put this finger here, okay? You can do the G just like this. Then E minor, which is this chord, and the D. So, a super, super simple song. Uh, the problem is just this finger picking pattern that we have to practice more okay um, so uh, on this verse part the say part or the B part you can use this finger picking pattern alternating between the thumb middle thumb index and sing along really just that for example like this see Just 
string what we learn on the first bar. E minor, uh, etc. So if you learn this uh, picking pattern, uh, you can use it all through the song and you'll be able to play the song, which in structural terms, it's very, very simple. So I hope this helps and have fun playing this song. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye. See you. Greetings from Portugal.